I'm not a tool maker, I'm a machinist. That's where my aptitude lies. A tool maker is geared to making dies and punches and that sort of thing, whereas machinists are more um, maybe research oriented. My father was very handy, is very handy, TV technician at Sears. How did I get here? It was word of mouth that uh, there was an open house here at Carleton University and uh, most of my class from Algonquin showed up and we were just uh, running around from building to building enjoying ourselves and someone mentioned there was a, a machine shop so of course we gravitated towards it and uh, I went to the machine shop and I remember uh, speaking with numerous machinists there and asking if there was uh, any positions open, that sort of thing, and they told me who to talk to, and I spoke to the bosses and put my resume in right away, and I was hired within a week. Other universities come to us on quite a regular basis, uh, currently doing work with McGill. Word of mouth from them to other scientists at NRC. There's a project in-house now for NRC. It's an imaging device. Now uh, we're, we're almost complete that one and McGill's back in the door. Anyone who wants to come can. I mean, uh, back in the heyday of uh, high tech, they, there was Nortel walking in the door. What other sort of projects? Well, we have uh, the Children's Hospital come here and they do research. So we build all sorts of apparatuses for them. We built an artificial uh, wrist joint. It was a complete motion artificial wrist joint. Bank of Canada came to us, had us make uh, banknote readers. You would put a banknote in it and it would speak the banknote and it would tell you it's a $5 bill or a $20 bill. This is for the blind so that when they receive change from someone, okay, they, yeah. they'd know what they're getting. I get great satisfaction after building something. Quite often when it's a one of it, uh, I hate to see it leave. It's my baby and I, and I don't want it to go because I really put myself into my work. I look at the details and, and pay attention to them and then it's like, oh, jeez, it's got to go. <laughs> so I, I definitely photograph things well.